Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. I'm Carly. And I'm Ange. And today we're watching One Piece episode 8. So last episode actually ended off with probably my favourite. I'm sure you agree as well. It's probably my favourite scene, I would say, uh, from this series so far. Yep, definitely. Yeah, so Nami was uh, in desperate need of some help. Luffy came with his boys. It was epic. It, it was, was really cool. And now they're going to try to take down Arlong. Now, I feel like they need a little bit of help. Yes. I think you were theorizing last episode that the military might step in and help them out. The Marines. The Marines. Yeah. Yeah, the Marines. So I really can't see them defeating Arlong and his crew without that extra help. Yeah. Like, Garp is quite interesting. I feel like when Garp sees the situation, he'd probably want to take down Arlong before Luffy. Well, yeah, he probably doesn't want to see Luffy hurt either. Yeah, he, he's an interesting character, Garp. Yeah, he uh, is. We're going to have to break him down a little bit more, um, maybe in season two and onwards. But yeah, this is the finale. Hopefully it ends really well. The last few episodes have been really strong. So hopefully it just continues with that same quality. But anyway, should we get into it? Let's get into it. Oh, is this when they tattoo her? Yeah. She made a lot of sacrifices. Oh, yeah. At this age. You pay me 100 million berry. I don't care how you get it. Steal it if you have to. So there was never any respect from Nami. Nah. She, she always hated him from the very start. Yes, rightfully like, so. I was under the impression when it got revealed that she was part of the crew that maybe, you know, there was some sort of affection there or something. Mm. Just a little bit. Or a sense of like family. They're gonna fight back. Okay. Nice. Let's go, sis. This is my fight. No. This is our fight. <laughs> right, guys? Oh. I won't hesitate. Well, let's go, Luffy. Take him down. That's probably the coolest artwork. There. Yeah, that's sick, isn't it? Do they do that in the anime? Question for you guys. Yeah, like after the um, the OP. Mm -hmm. I hate this bloke. He probably pisses me off the most. <laughs> he's just a dickhead. Oh. All around dickhead. Got no idea what the bloody hell he's doing. Yeah. He's just sarcastic all the time. Tracking Arlong. They say. <laughs> oh, for goodness sakes. What? No. Cadets. It's not possible. Are you calling me a liar, boy? Yep. Just look at your face. <laughs> you do no such thing. Where yeah, he can't have that. Where is Let's pick up the I think he just wants to chat. Be interested to see what he has to say to him. Yeah. I found it hard to read Garb all this time. Same. Oh shit. Take him down first! Please. <laughs> oh. They're all ready. Come on, Usopp. Monsoro, Sanji, guys. Yes. Oh shit! Yes. Let's go. Oh. <laughs> oh yes. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Oh yeah, oh, she's still no. hurt. Still wipe the floor with take them. Take it easy. Let's go. Oh shit. Oh. If I was Usopp, I'd be shitting. Oh, yeah. I'd be shitting everywhere. Yeah. <laughs> you let me stop wearing them when I was 12. Said it was a birthday gift. Come on. Let's go. She's opening up to him now. Mm. Like, fully trusts him. Uh, what is that weapon in his hand? Oh, that was on the, the logo. Oh, yeah, shit. If I was Usopp, I would have ran towards Zoro. Sanji. Yeah. Now he's isolated himself plan. in the damn forest. 
with this fish. Oh yeah. <laughs> nah, that's a no for me. Oh, these guys are epic, man. Mm -hmm. Oh! <laughs> yeah. I like that. <laughs> oh no, they're all in the water. <sighs> I love that. He's got his hands in his pockets most of the time when he's yeah, fighting. Yeah, he's so sick. Oh my goodness, man. He doesn't use people. Oh shit. Hey, that's pissed him off. Oh yeah. Okay, he's broken the sword. Oh shit. <laughs> oh shit, so it's gonna be Luffy versus Arlong. Yeah, I'm the stressed, rematch. but I really want... I really want Arlong done. I just hate the guy. I need this guy. I need him dead, Carly. <laughs> no, I do. No, he's got pent up frustration. Oh, yeah. get back in the kitchen. Oh, shit. Oh, this footwork is just everything. Hey. <laughs> that would feed him. <laughs> That's satisfying for sure. Oh, I forgot about Bobby. No, don't trust him, please. What do you think happens? Does he betray him or does he surprise us? I don't know. I'm getting better vibes from him. I was wrong. Oh! <laughs> I mean, he's uh, he's harmless. <sighs> he's not harmless. Zoro comes out with the F-bomb there. Oh, dear. He's all kinds of messed up. Or is he acting? I reckon he's tricked him. Put some tomato sauce on his chest. Ah. Oh. Yeah. Hey. <laughs> yeah, tomato sauce. He actually right? did. <laughs> neck flaps. He does have neck flaps. I don't catch fire. Maybe you don't. Get it in his mouth. Oh, the alcohol. <sighs> hey! Oh, that was so satisfying. Is he gonna get up from that? He's getting up. Usopp's too happy. No, I'm really happy for Usopp. I knew he was gonna get a moment. And to take out this dude. Oh, thrilling. I hate it when they go in the water. Oh, he's swimming with purpose there. Okay, this oh, this guy's tough. Yeah, yeah, this guy is tough. Yeah, he's strong. I've made him bleed. Good. Mm, oh, time for There's, his. Uh, you've just pissed him off more, Luffy. The shark teeth. Oh dear. <laughs> Like, I have nightmares about my teeth falling out like that. My kicks could break a ship's gill. That's nothing. You should have seen Zeph's kicks when he found the night chow in the court of Portland. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> Not the creme brulee. <laughs> That's such a warped perception of Yeah, I know. On. What the heck? Ah, oh, burn the maps. Yeah. Maybe I can't beat you. He's aiming for the map. You're plan. right. You're right. You built. 
Yes, Luffy. Set it on fire! I don't know how he's gonna do that. Oh, he's gonna. He's gonna yeah. take down the structural integrity of the. Um, yeah. Help me out. Engineering and stuff. No. Ah, oh. <laughs> he's doing it himself. Stupid fish. Kylie, what's the name of this place? What? <laughs> Are you still trying to finish think of what my it's sentence? Called? Building. It's a building. That doesn't work for me. I'm gonna say hideout. I'm just gonna have to roll with that. that. Sucks. Yeah, okay, I was Ooh. waiting for the suit jacket to come up. Okay. Oh, yeah. It's the loyalty. Yeah. You're screwed now, mate. What is that? It's it's different moves? Oh, yeah, this is straight from the anime. I don't know what he's saying, but it's kind of sexy. <laughs> well known fact. <laughs> yeah, that's what <laughs> Luffy said to him. Temple! Nice! Yes, Angelo! Wow, that's the one. What just happened? Sorry. Yeah, take it back. <laughs> and he's the one who fought for her, too. Breaking that. I love this actor, he's done a good job. Oh, he's doing a good job because he's really pissing me off. Oh shit. Oh, it's gonna chop him in half. Oh, that was sick! Oh. <laughs> yes! But I'm so stressed, she's gotta get out of there. Oh, they're gonna do that thing where everyone thinks he's like dead. Is he actually gonna be though? No, he's fine, Carly. Just like what? Oh yeah. 1100 episodes. <laughs> oh or some yeah. Shit. Holy crap. I think this covers like what 200, 300 or something. <sighs> yeah. <laughs> the almighty fist. That's their captain. Yeah, that was sick. Right Battle axe. <laughs> oh, I mean so much to her. Look at her face. You just saved her, her whole village. They just laugh at him because he's a bit of a dickhead. But, you know. That was great. I really love her, the actress. Yeah, she's Nami. fantastic. I was about I to say that. Lot. I think her name is Emily Rudd, maybe. Someone said. She's fantastic. Yeah. They're all very good, actually. I have to say, the cast is yeah. definitely a strength. Oh. He didn't mind that. No, he didn't mind that. Zoro liked that one. <laughs> he's got to tell people about it. Surrounded by fishmen. Aww. <laughs> they didn't do the three cheers. Oh, you just gotta come and ruin the party. They were having a nice time. I'll get out. I don't think that's what's gonna happen here. They just saved a village. They're gonna get a pass. Oh, shit. Dang. Oh! Oh, you were right! Yeah, I knew you were all right. Along. He had a gentle face. Give me a hug. Come on. He's so unpredictable. I just have no idea. Oh shit. Okay. And show me what you've got. Are you oh. serious? Yeah. yeah, man's strong. We've seen what he can do to a room. Throwing his desks everywhere. Is, Is it that the ring? ring something? That yeah, does the ring give him the power? Maybe. Oh, there you go. Oh. He's gonna sandwich him. Oh, crap. 
Oh no, he's not. He's gonna slingshot himself. Yeah, yeah. Oh, hate. Yeah. Gob. He's stronger than Arlong. He did something similar to Arlong, and like. This Grand Line's gonna have so many crazy characters. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, no. Like old Roger. Yeah, that's, that's a terrifying sight for him. As his grandfather, I actually have to kind of side with Garb for a second there. What about these straw hats? What about? Arrest them too. They are the real criminals. Thank you. Yes. Yes. <laughs> she is great. You were testing me. What the hell? Where's the fun in that? They're actually they're quite similar in a lot of ways. I'll discuss it in the discussion. She's gonna. She's gonna have a tangerine. Nice. I hope you'd be proud of me. She was always proud of me. I was. I knew. She, I knew she was gonna Aww. come here. A little sore. She got a different. Worth it. Different tattoo. What is that? Oh, is that the same as hers? Maybe. Yeah, it is. This will always be Nice. She got a massive, like, character arc in this yeah. first season, Nami. She did. Oh, she left it for her mama. Oh, oh nice. <laughs> they had heaps of those, remember? Yeah. I want to show you something. I don't think Garp would let him leave. Oh, it's official. <laughs> <laughs> uh, oh. You're legit now. <laughs> <laughs> I think he would have that reaction. That's so yeah. funny. Kobe, oh. remember, that's nice. This is such a funny <laughs> conversation. <laughs> no. He's not just gonna. Garb's not gonna just let him retire. Oh, Garb didn't let Luffy become a pirate either. You see what I'm saying? People do what they want. <laughs> Get that laminated. I don't think Stick they're gonna it up be. On the wall. I don't think they're gonna be excited. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> She's just joined back and now she's got to deal with this. Is he in there too? Oh! <laughs> We're going to the <laughs> Yes, let's go. Oh, she's going to see Luffy in the papers. Oh. Was this the woman at the start? Yeah. She was part of Shanks. Oh, she's proud. She sees him there in the bottom left. Yeah, Usopp. That's epic! Oh, she misses him. Nice. <laughs> Zeph was one of my favorites. Honestly, yeah. He's pissed. <laughs> this guy, it. I reckon he's like. Alveda. Oh dear. No. I hate to say it, but she's a bottom character. They belong together, these two. He's a little puppy dog, though, I feel like. He's, Doggy? Yeah. Except when you give him, like, civilians and stuff like that. But I'm saying in the grand scheme of things, he's harmless. You see, that's what I was saying. Mm, yeah, you were. 
want to show people that Romano is our isn't the only one that knows how to use swords. He wants to learn how to sword fight. Like well, he was really bad. Before. Oh, yeah. Yeah, he was too. He called him his friend. <laughs> that was so unexpected. It is your time. I don't think it was. Not for you. His dad just. He treated him like shit. Oh, yeah, yeah. This is an unusual oh. place for a man of your stature. Thanks. A boy you mentioned long ago. Oh, shit. <laughs> oh, he tried to protect him from this too, though, didn't he? You really did it. No way. You flipped me. He's a pirate. Aww. So proud of him. I guess we're gonna watch our backs. Oh wait, isn't Usopp's dad here too? Yeah. It's a little piece of home to take with you in our journey. Oh, yes. <laughs> oh, look at that. <laughs> Saji. It's so beautiful. <laughs> Picking up a recipe already. Oh shit. Oh. Oh. <laughs> That's so epic. That was awesome. Yeah. The straw hat. Oh, Luffy. Oh, he's gonna faint. He loves it. That's nice how they did that. Yeah, that's so nice. <laughs> Is that in the anime logo too? <laughs> I think it might be. Well, it looks like a river or a canal or something, but it doesn't make Oh dear, sense. are they going to go off some How cliff or something? Oh, what? That sounds interesting. Yeah. All hands on deck for a cast off ceremony. Ceremony? What? Are they called the straw hats now, are they? Okay. I guess they're not going to have to wear the hats, but it's not about that. No, they were always called the straw hat pirates. Were they? Yeah. I'm going to find the old blue. Oh. I'm going to be king of the pirates. Oh. I love that. That's great. I'm going to be the world's greatest swordsman. Yep. This is peak right here. Mm-hmm. That's got some tears out of me, that one. It's gonna become a bright water on the sea! <laughs> I like that. That's so cute. His, his story starts here, it seems. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that was a really good last scene, that. Yeah, I loved that. That uphill river has me intrigued. Yeah, it's interesting, isn't it? I hope we get like a snake... snake preview. Oh shit, okay. Who is this? Someone's not very happy about it. Uh, that's gotta be some sort of easter egg. That's why they call it One Peak. <laughs> that was really good. Yeah. I haven't heard that one yet. No, I feel like for pretty much every anime, the word peak is somehow intertwined yeah, it, in it. incorporated, yeah. <laughs> yeah, into the title somehow. But no, that was a really good final episode. Mm -hmm. Definitely the uh, second half of the series was way better than the first, in my opinion. Yeah. Five, six, seven, and eight just... Stepped it up and off. Yeah, stepped it way up. Like, that was good. I personally find it hard to... Well, not hard. It's just been a while since I've enjoyed a live action that's like not a k-drama yeah exactly i found myself really enjoying that same especially the second half that yeah. was like very strong i feel because i am quite picky when it comes to watching live action stuff that's why you don't see too much on the channel because generally we don't really like it yeah <laughs> um but this was really good i'm very excited for season two as well we see a lot of comments asking if we're going to react to the anime look at some point we probably will probably unless we lose the channel somehow there's a good chance that we will, because then we'll never run out of content. Cause That's true. <laughs> it'll probably be 2,000 episodes at that point. But that was really good. That, I think, from what I heard, they covered 
a couple of hundred episodes or something like that. But I Dang. I felt like you couldn't notice the jumps too much. Um, oh, you mean from like villain to villain? Well, just the pacing in general didn't feel like it would be 100 to 200 no, anime yeah. episodes. I feel like it flowed quite well. Yeah. There were points in which you could see the characters had spent a bit of time with each other. I feel like they made a, a point of that. Um, cause there were moments in the earlier episodes where the characters just, they were more chummy with each other already. It's like they had known right. each other for a while. Okay. That I was felt the vibe that, I was Actually, getting. I felt that with Zoro. He was kind yeah. of just on board like straight away. It felt like in the live action. Yeah. Yeah. I feel like it's implied that they've at that point already spent some time together. Right. Okay. Yeah. But let's talk about the last episode. I have to say, uh, Nami probably, she stole the show for me. Mm. I, I think in the, the last half of this. You, you guys could probably see we were a little bit um, cautious of Nami, I think, early on. Yeah. Uh, we're getting a little bit frustrated that maybe, you know, she was... Hiding some things. Yeah, betraying the crew and stuff like that. But she turned into such a, a really well-written character. Yeah. Um, the actress, I believe her name is Emily Rudd. Um, sorry if I got that wrong. They were all good actors, but she was a standout for me. Yeah, her story and the way she acted in it. Yep. And from what I'm hearing from you guys on YouTube and some of the guys on Patreon too. She really loves like the actual anime. Oh yeah. Um, she's a fan of anime in general. I'm pretty sure um, from what we've been told. I also think that the little girl that played her as a child was probably the best child actress too. Yeah. Um, I would say her and Sanji's child actor as well. Yeah. No, not to compare the actors. I mean, they were all great. I, I feel like the standout for this series or this live action adaptation was probably the um the cast the actors and the diverse characters i guess or like um how different all the characters were yeah and how the actors brought that out Mm -hmm. and how they all like worked so well together in the end like of course we have sanji and zoro they've got a little bit of a (laughs) you know a little bit of a hatred thing going there's no hatred it's like a like a brotherly sort of... Mm. Yeah, it's like a competition, like a healthy competition sort of thing. Yeah, yeah. Almost, yeah. It's like you're fighting for that alpha, that alpha position. Almost, yeah. I like all the crew members, every single one of them. Yep. Um, which is definitely a bonus. You don't expect to like every single character, like mm-hmm. when you're watching something. But, I mean, you can't complain when you leave the series or the first season liking every single crew member. 100%, yeah. Um, so I thought all of them were good. I thought the villains were good as well. I did not enjoy Adveda. And I'm oh, no, excited Alveda. that yeah. she's back. Look, there were some characters that I did not like and I was not interested in at all. I will say, though, the characters that I enjoyed far outweigh the characters that I didn't enjoy. Yeah. There were just so many good ones. Yeah. Like, but I didn't think we needed her back. <laughs> no, Alveda, no, probably not. I don't know what sort of a role she plays in the anime, but... Mm. Um, yeah, I'm not invested in Alveda. I don't really care for her. <laughs> Buggy's almost like that comedic punching bag of a villain. Uh, in terms of like some of the characters that I just don't really care about. Well, originally I, I wasn't that invested in Kobe, but Kobe kind of, he come good. I think Kobe adds a lot to Garp's character and I'm quite interested in Garp. Yeah, I kind of always got at the back of my mind that Kobe will leave the Marines. However, it's all about your dream, right? And his dream was always to be a Marine. Yeah. So maybe he won't join the crew. I don't know. I just always thought that he would. Well, I really liked the Marines in this episode or like what eventuated because they'd spent time trying to catch Luffy and then I guess they saw that they were doing good even though they were pirates. So it's like you don't need to punish them or anything like that. Like just punish the bad people, let the good people do their good deeds or that sort of thing. Um, and I quite liked that from Garp at the end. So it was almost as if he was keeping just a close eye on his grandson. He was hard to read at times. Um, I, I do feel like they could have handled that a little bit better. Like things could have been a little bit more clearer to us. Yeah, I was under the impression that they wanted us to be confused by his character a little bit, but I'm not sure if it's. Yeah, I'm not sure if that's the case. I I liked him as a character, like by the end of it, because it's funny you can actually draw quite a few parallels between. Garp and Luffy. This is what I was trying to mention during the episode. Garp, like, they made a point of of him being Vice Admiral and not moving up because he wanted to always just do his own thing. And that's kind of like Luffy. Luffy's that free spirit as well, wants to follow his dream. Yeah. Uh, wants his crew members to chase their dreams, all that sort of thing. So he probably sees a lot of himself in Luffy. There was that part at the end where Garp didn't give 
Kobe. What's the other guy's name? Hel Helmepo. Hel Helmepo. Helmepo. Helmepo and Kobe. Can I see if I got that right? Just give me a sec. I was correct. Helmepo. Yep. You didn't say it with confidence, though. It was Helmepo. Before, I mean. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Anyway, yeah. Yeah. he did not give them punishments. Instead, he, like, rewarded them, which mm. I get. Like, they stood up for the right thing, but I don't know. It was just kind of a moment for me where I was like, eh. No, see, I liked that personally because you could see all the other Marines were kind of just like sheep. Garp's not a sheep. I think he respects the fact that uh, Kobe and Helmepo weren't in that moment. Mm, okay. It's not like they were being ridiculous or anything like that as well. Like, they stood up for a pretty, like, noble reason or whatever, so. Yeah. Um, I just thought it sent a message to the rest of the Marines. That you can do whatever you want? Yeah, sort of. Yeah, there's that too. I, I get that point. Yeah. I, I feel like the whole Marines and the Garp thing was a mixed bag. That wasn't the highlight of the series for me. Mm. I just really loved the crew, their stories, their backstories, all of that. I thought was... Oh, I didn't like Zoro's backstory. Yeah. That was the weakest episode for me personally, episode Same. four. Yeah, I agree. Doesn't take away from Zoro's character. We still love him. Like, he's, he's a top character for us, for sure. I think by the end of it, my favorite character was probably Sanji. Yeah. It's I, tough to decide between the two. Yeah, even Nami's like a really good character too. It, it's it's rough. I, I do like all of the crew. I think they're all quite strong. I just, yeah, I felt like Zoro's backstory just didn't hit. Yeah, it didn't hit me either. I'm assuming season two covers like, what, episode 200 to 400 or something in the anime. Oh, I've got no idea. But I feel they've set up the end of this season or the start of next season like already really well like they've had this villain guy at the end who put his like cigar on um luffy's face that's got to be stuff. foreshadowing of course yeah they wouldn't just put that in for no reason that's foreshadowing but they've got that they've got the buggy and advita alvita say with confidence <laughs> no because i'm not confident in her yeah okay <laughs> they've set up that pairing there well Alvita's going to have something to do with Kobe again. Like, there's going to be that sort of thing. Yeah. Uh, that will get revisited for sure. Mm -hmm. um, she sucks. I reckon they're going to just be the punching bags, that crew. Alvita, Buggy. Yeah. They suck. <laughs> yeah, they do. <laughs> um, I don't want her taking up screen time. <laughs> no, no, same. I'll be honest. Neither, yeah, that's the same with me. Yeah, so maybe we can expect Luffy to get a pretty severe eye injury. Or lose his eye potentially in the next season. Um, his eye. Yeah, that's why I was talking about foreshadowing that the the oh, villain burnt burnt his eye off. Oh right! Yeah, I thought that you meant like no. he's gonna be in the next season. It was foreshadowing that. No, like what? No, they made <laughs> like, a thing of crap, it. Angelo. That, of course, he's gonna be in next season. No, they made a thing of it for I sure. See. Like that looked like that had Easter egg energy. Mm. You know what I'm saying? Like it's very specific. You just put it in his on, on one of his okay. eyes. Okay. Um. So there's that. You've also got the the river on the mountain, that thing. Yeah, that in, that interests me. I I feel like they can have a lot of fun with it. Yeah. Uh, I feel like the set could be really yeah. really nice. Yeah, I feel like the sets were really good. Yeah, they were as well. They were spectacular. Uh, the the costumes is that is that the right word? What do you use? What yeah. Word? Yeah. The fittings. Yep. The clothes. And I will say the makeup and the special effects on the fishmen were insane as well. Yeah, but some of it, like, I felt like some of it was hit or miss. I guess that's just the world of One Piece. It's just like very random. Um, it, oh, right. Okay. Yeah, I was just, yeah, like sometimes I was just confused. Like everyone just looks so different, but sometimes that's a good thing. I just don't know if that suits live action is what I'm getting at. Right. But, but it's fine. Yes. I felt like it, it did end up encapsulating that world quite well. So I'm like, okay with that. Yeah, I feel like I would have preferred for them to do what they did with all the special effects and makeup mm. than not. Yeah, I guess, yeah, it would have taken away from what that world is actually meant to look like. Yeah, I guess. like yeah. I appreciated the, um, I don't know, the visual appeal to it. Yeah, the music was good as well. Um, I really liked the soundtrack. Uh, so all in all, I'd probably give it a pretty high rating. I did find myself enjoying it. At the middle section, I was kind of like, this could go either way. Yeah. If it didn't step up after that, like, midpoint in the show, if it we just, didn't get yeah. those phenomenal episodes, it would be like... Just a mid-tier. Yeah, a mid-tier sort of show for me. But yeah. 
those last episodes really like yeah push it up a lot yeah fair play to the actors as well i personally hadn't i i didn't know any of them no um, neither i hadn't seen any of the actors before i don't think mm, true I, I feel like i have seen sanji's actor before though i feel like i have seen him in something but th- that's it that was like the only familiar face and they were all very good in their roles for sure they would have mm. had a lot of pressure coming into this uh, anime adaptations, like, into oh, live yeah. action, that, that doesn't have a good track record. Because you got, like, such a long anime, right? It's got probably such a huge fan base. Oh, no, it does have a yes. massive fan base, So yeah. with all that pressure to, yeah. like, really provide for those diehard fans for the show. Yeah. Yeah, that's a lot. Yeah, fair play to them, for sure. Yeah, they would have had a lot of pressure going into this. Mm. And you could tell that they really tried to bring a lot to their characters. Thank you so much for watching our reaction. If you liked it, please give us a thumbs up and subscribe. It would really help us out. For early access to all of our reactions, you can support us on Patreon if you'd like. And yeah, thank you so much again. We'll see you in the next one. Bye.